Hi guys, this is Alex at Black Box My Car. GoPro cameras are a revolution in consumer technology and for good reason. They are a reliable, durable, and high quality camera for half the price of prosumer digital cameras. Everyone and their nephew has a GoPro these days, which means innovative users have cooked up a variety of creative uses for them. From sinking them into 120 feet deep wells to launching them into orbit at 3,800 miles per hour, GoPros are about as versatile a camera as money can buy. That's led others to use them in less extreme ways, such as a car dash cam. But how do GoPros stack up to actual dashboard cameras? At Black Box My Car, we research the key benefits and downsides of using an action sports cam as a dash cam. Aside from GoPro's high quality video capture and the option on newer models for looped recording, the camera turns out to be a little too much of a generalist to stack up to products from dashcam manufacturers like Thinkware and Blackview. Pros and cons of using a GoPro as a dashcam. Starting off with the pros of the GoPro as a dashcam, we have camera quality and lens view angle. The GoPro not only excels in these departments, it's one of the better cameras you can buy for high quality, ultra wide angles. Additionally, looped recording is included as a base feature of the device, which allows the memory card to continue overriding itself when full in order to keep saving new footage until something worth saving happens. The list of cons we discovered for the GoPro as a dashcam device is more extensive. First of all, the GoPro is expensive compared to many dashcams, and it's also very recognizable. Having a GoPro mounted on your dash at all times is showing everyone that passes by your vehicle what you have inside. People know how much GoPros cost, and it could be an invitation for theft. A traditional dash cam is designed to be sleek on a dashboard and inconspicuous to passerby. It's also designed to withstand extreme temperature on a car dashboard, something that the GoPro just can't handle. Next, the GoPro likes features inherent to almost every price level dash cam, such as the ability to auto launch when you turn on the vehicle. The dash cams get hardwired into the vehicle's fuse box to take advantage of parking mode as well. For the average GoPro user, those features just aren't necessary. However, when you start using one as a dash cam, you will quickly realize how frustrating it is to deal with on a constant basis. Actual dash cams are made to work with little input from you until you need the footage following an accident or some other event. The final thing that sets the GoPro down a few pegs from even mid-tier dash cams is the number of useful software features. What useful dashcam features is the GoPro missing? To put it bluntly, GoPros are missing almost every feature that makes dashcam so perfect for recording video in a vehicle. The simple ability for a dashcam to instantly turn on and start capturing video means you don't have to fiddle with it at all, and things get better from there. Many dashcams offer two-channel functionality. You can capture video from two different cameras in the same clip automatically, which covers more footage of your vehicle with very little hassle. Imagine setting and configuring two GoPros to get the same effect. Your car would become a mess of extension cords and wiring just to keep them powered for a long drive. Many middle and higher tier dashcams are able to use motion detection as well as G-Force sensors to automatically save important moments. They lock the files away so you can be confident that they are safely stored away from you after an accident or break-in. Parking mode is another smart feature in high-end dashcams. When you shut off and exit your vehicle, the dash Dashcam acts as an extra set of eyes. It will keep an eye on your vehicle while you're gone and automatically capture anything suspicious. Certain dashcams such as the Thinkware F800 Pro also offer lane departure warnings, GPS tracking, and geofencing to track and alert you of the vehicle's location. The F800 Pro is a perfect example of how dashcams go above and beyond a GoPro's capabilities. These features and even more are proof of why it's always better to buy a dedicated dashcam instead of trying to adapt a GoPro into a functional product for your needs. Verdict. Although the GoPro includes high quality recording with the wide angle lens, it lacks the many automated set it 
and forget it features that many dash cams had built in. As a recording device made for extreme sports and getting dirty, the GoPro excels. For your vehicle security and peace of mind while driving and parked, we recommend sticking with the dash cam and using parking mode recording. Thank you for watching our video. We have so many dash cam options at Black Box My Car. Please come check us out on social media for the latest updates, contests, as well as upcoming dashcam news. Comment if you have any questions, and if you like the video, please give us a thumbs up and subscribe.